Hello everyone and welcome back to another box opening. We have, again, our fourth box of Battles of Legend Monstrous Revenge. So, I've done enough intros on these with the channel already because I've already opened three of these. So, we're just going to get right into it. Talk as we go. I'll give a shout out again to uh, Eclectic where I've been picking up my sealed Yu-Gi-Oh products. I've been starting to stock some more and I'm uh, excited to keep on rolling with the packs that I get from there. So. Here we go. Ghost Lancer. Don't Slip Dogs of War. Protection of the Elements. Curse of Air Mater. And Shadow's Light. New card. I uh, pulled one of those in the last box. Goes along kind of with uh, Duality. I don't know if it's seen a whole lot of play yet. Um, duality is definitely a lot more popular. Helps that it's a quick play, so. Shogi Rook. Apparatus Tessia. Ghost Fusion. Ghost Waver of the Underworld. And RGB Rainbow Lucian. First time for that card there. Guard Mantis. Don't Slip Dogs of War. Protection of the Elements, Xiaomin, and Shadow's Light. So there we go. Look, playset. I have a playset. Pulled two from this box in the first three packs. That's crazy. Pack number four. Macro Cosmos, Constellar Diamond, Final Cross, Rose Shaman, and Synchro Zone. Spell trap, spell trap. <clears throat> Anticorn, Mathematic Equation, Sage of Benevolence, Odd Eyes Rebellion, and Terraforming. Pulled a few of those, it's not bad. Good reprint, super rare, makes it cheaper. Fairly common in this set as one of the secrets. Shingra the Waning Moon, Eratama, Classic Uribo, Dijin Buster, and Punk Amazing Dragon. So I did pull um, a bunch of punk from these boxes. I actually got a playset of everything that's included in these boxes. Um, there's a few from this set that don't that weren't printed in this, so um, I'd stop pick it up to do uh I'm thinking about doing a punk, punk pick. Xyz Bento, Waning Moon, Sprite Smashers, Mother Spider Splitter, and Duality. There we go. I was just talking about this card. Um, better version of Shadow's Light. I pulled one. Here's my second. So we should be on our way to getting the uh, playset. It's a nice card. One of the higher value of the secrets in this set. Puppet Rook, Puppet Pawn, Classic Uribo, Xiaomin, and Danger Nessie. Almost done with this side. I think we have uh, three packs left. Maybe four. Starlit Palpalon, Arms Regeneration. DDD Super Dimensional Sovereign Emperor Zero Paradox Underworld Princess and Golden Rule. It's nice having all four of that. You can see all the things and ultras and secrets. Lamia Photon Banisher Praying Mantis Avatar of Malice and Tri Edge Master. This is the third pack from the bottom on this first side. Promotion. Ghost Lancer. Noble Arms of Light. Mother Spider Splitter. And IP Mascarina. I pulled my quarter century. It was on the bottom. Last pack, actually. 
Lamias, Viper's Grudge, Dark Arm Dragon, Shirakuzai, and Battlefield Tragedy. Last pack for this first side here. Guard Mantis, Additional Mirror Level 7, Link Decoder, Barakaribo, and Super Poly. That's a great reprint there. I still have sometimes a hard time deciding if I like the secrets or ultras better or some cards. Super Poly is one of them. Ah, uh, Lamia, Catticorn, Barakaribo, Himmel, and Rite of Aramis here. That's pretty cool right there. Um, I've been looking for a lot of the adventure package stuff and actually traded um, that quarter century Bastille Rebellion that I pulled um, from the second box I opened of Monstrous Revenge um, for a set of rights that are um, German version from Green Creators. Viper's Grudge, Promotion, Odd Eyes Butler, Underworld Princess, and Mysterion on the Dragon Crown. All right, let me get back on the third on the side, second side here. Waning Moon, Ball Drake. I got my uh, complete set now. Crane Mantis, Final Cross, Dark Magician, The Knight of Dragon Magic. So I have my uh, full set of Bastille Ball Drake Hollow upgrades for my collection. I guess you only really use one ball drake most of the time, but got all my bestials right now in Dragon Link, so Sage Strength Akash, Baby Spider, Rising Carp, Forest of Lost Flowers, and Diadartan, the Ooze Giant. Interesting. That's the first time pulling that one as well. Akitama, Puppet Pawn, Praying Mantis, Dark Arm Dragon, and Rocket Coder. Caddy Core, Baby Spider, Protection of the Elements, Super Dimensional Sovereign, and Photon Jumper. Okay, my box might have gotten shook up, and I can't even pack some first set up, and I do this second set here. So they shorted me some packs. That'd be crazy. Akash, Guard Mantis, Ghost Wavering, Classic Uribo, and Mysterion the Dragon Crown. Number two from this pack. Or this box. All right, we're getting close to the bottom here. Puppet Pawn, Math Mech Equation, Underworld Dragon, Noble Arms of Light, and Assault Synchron. I already have my playset, but it's nice to pull another because I think uh, post Duelist Nexus, he might become a little worth a little bit more money than he is now. So that'll be a good one to hang on to and sell. Additional Mirror Level 7, Photon Vanisher, Rising Carp. Mother Spider Splitter, and Punk Amazing Dragon. All right, we got two more packs. Let's hope for the good pool. Dark Palace, Eritama, Barakaribo, uh, Sage of Benevolence, and Book of Eclipse. All right, last pack. Let's see if we get it. Starlight Rare, like in my second box. Let's see if we can chase that uh, quarter century rare. Excuse me. Xyz Bento. Sage of Strength Akash. Odd Eyes Butler. Link Decoder. And Ogre Dance. So we uh, didn't get the quarter century in this one, which is a little sad. Uh, four boxes from the same case. So a lot of those other boxes. Uh, I think they're basically four, four, to, four to a case, roughly, um, is what the pull rates have been. So, 
in that uh, second third of this case. <laughs> probably a few more boxes in there that have of course entry rare so um anyway thank you guys for joining me for this uh box opening again um tried to make it a little shorter but i think it came around to the same amount of time i uh, didn't do too bad here pulled the duality which is uh one of my favorite hits here and i got a few cards that you know i completed out some play sets and might be able to uh sell together for a better price then anyway thank you guys for watching if you uh, like the content or have any uh, constructive criticism. I'd also like to hear that if you like, comment, subscribe. Thank you.